Hi everybody, I'm Andrea. I'm here at Back to Nature Wildlife Refuge. Today I'm going to introduce you to Gretchen, one of our eastern gray squirrels. <laughs> Trying to get her a snack. <laughs> so Gretchen came to us about four years ago. She celebrated her fourth birthday recently in November. Uh, when she came to us, she had taken a fall as a baby. She was about four weeks old at the time. She had a broken leg and it was later noticed during her rehabilitation that her front two incisors were growing crooked. Um, and that's because they weren't developed yet at the time of the fall. So unfortunately, this injury resulted in Gretchen having to have a surgery to remove the incisors so that's why she is a permanent resident. Since Gretchen is a little camera shy at the moment, I will also introduce you to Junior. Junior is another Eastern Gray Squirrel. He arrived also as a baby to Back to Nature in 2017. He was exhibiting symptoms of an eye infection at the time of his intake, but we later discovered that he was actually permanently blind in one of his eyes. Now, since squirrels are prey animals, it's very important for them to have vision in both eyes in the wild. Here's a close-up of what squirrel teeth look like. Now, as you can see, they're not only very long and sharp, but they also have that orange color to them. And that's a result of high levels of magnesium in their enamel. One of the most recognizable features of an eastern gray squirrel is this awesome floofy tail. So in the wild, this tail has many purposes. For example, on a hot day like today and most days in Florida, if a squirrel is feeling that heat and wants to get out of the direct sunlight, it works like an umbrella shade. In a similar way, in the cold weather, if they are shivering and need to keep warm, they have this nice built-in blanket that they can just cover up with and get nice and cozy. If a squirrel, unfortunately, happens to fall in the water, they can actually swim. And this awesome tail works like a rudder to propel them through the water. How cool is that? Thank you guys so much for watching our video. I hope you enjoyed meeting Gretchen and Junior. And stay tuned for more animal encounters with Back to Nature.